यू आर लिस्निंग मनोपात्रा पॉडकास्ट स्टेट यून टू गेट लेटेस्ट लीगल अपडेट्स Greetings everyone Manupatra brings to you the news highlights of 16th March 2023 starting with the Supreme Court The Supreme Court has held that once a rural area is urbanized by issuance of notification under section 507 sub clause A of Delhi Municipal Corporation Act 1957 the provisions of Delhi Land Reforms Act 1954 cease to apply The court while observing that wills cannot be proved only on the basis of their age has held that presumption under section 90 as to the regularity of documents more than 30 years of age is inapplicable when it comes to the proof of wills the court has held that resolution professional is entitled to take control of the rights of a corporate debtor in assets which are licensed to third parties under section 25 of the insolvency and bankruptcy code 2016 news highlights of the high courts starting with the delhi high court The Delhi High Court while observing that private schools are dependent on the fees collected by them from the students has held that merely because schools maintain surplus it cannot be understood as commercialization of education. The High Court while observing that banks cannot be loaded with the responsibility of getting real estate projects completed has held that it is for the lenders to take appropriate legal action by approaching the civil forum to ensure that the project is completed on time. News highlights from other high courts in the country. The Bombay High Court while observing that court under section 151 and 152 of CPC has the power to rectify errors has allowed corrections to be made in a sale deed after 38 years. The Meghalaya High Court has rejected the state's grandiose blueprint to deploy 160 companies of CRPF in eastern and western range respectively to curb illegal coal mining. has observed that cost implication even on short term or temporary basis may make this plan unfeasible the jammu and kashmir and ladakh high court has observed that there has been a paradigm shift in approach of the courts in exercise of the writ jurisdiction in the matters of contractual disputes with state and citizens can in appropriate cases approach the high courts for exercise of writ jurisdiction the calcutta high court while granting interim relief to tabar has directed dhruv rathi to remove the offending portions from the video where he specifically disparaged their packaged food products real juice violating dabar's trademark by unauthorized use of packaging label and logo of product this concludes the news for today thank you so much